How to digitally sign a document using dotted sign. First, you need to install dotted sign on your cell phones. To install dotted sign, go to Google Play Store and then search for dotted sign. And then download dotted sign, e-sign and fill documents with this icon. So install it on your cell phones. Once it is installed, just open it, click allow, and then it will open. You need to sign up since you just downloaded dotted sign. So click sign me up, and then you can choose between the two, sign up with Facebook or sign up with Google. For me, I will use the second one, sign up with Google. So you have to choose an account for your uh, dotted sign. You need to sign up an account, an existing Google account. Once you have already signed up, it will ask you to confirm your email address and resend email verification uh, through your Gmail. So you have to go to the email address you provided. Go to Gmail and verify your KDAN ID to start using dotted line. So, click the message. Click on verify my KDAN ID. Once you have verified your account, ganito yung home. Ganito yung lalabas. Default uh, appearance ng home. So, to start, i-click mo lang yung plus sign. And then, sign yourself. Makakakita ka ng tatlong options. Scan, photo, browse. Piliin natin si browse. And then, i-direct ka niya sa mga files mo sa cellphone. Make sure na yung pipirmahan mong document is downloaded in your cellphone. At make sure it is in PDF. So, kailangan naka-PDF yung file na pipirmahan. So, click mo lang yung file. And then, skip. Ito, lalabas na yung file. And then, next. Ayan. So, ito yung document natin for signature. To start uh, making or putting your e-signature, click natin tong uh, sign sa dulo, yung parang ball pen. Then, uh, meron siyang default, uh, meron siyang signature na gina ginamit ko dati, so binura ko lang. And then, then, click lang natin tong add signature. Yan. Tapos, magiging landscape yung ating uh, create signature. Pwede ka nang pumirma dito. So, for example, J H D L A Cruz. And then, kung okay na yan, uh, ikiklik mo yung done. Pero kung nagkamali ka, for example, click mo lang tong clear. Yan. Pwede ka nang pumirma ulit. For example, ito yung pirma. Kung okay na siya, i-click mo lang yung done. Saving. So, magiging portrait ulit. Then, kung tapos ka na, i-click mo lang yung signature. Ayan. Tapos, i-resize mo lang. Itapat mo kung saan dapat na doon yung pirma. Yeah. Now you're done uh, putting signatures sa iyong 
uh, PDF file. So, ganun lang kadali maglagay ng signature using dotted line. Ngayon, kung nakikita nyo, merong option na delete. Kung nagkamali ka, uh, pwede mo siyang i-delete. Pero, uh, kung gusto mo lang siyang ilipat ng pwesto, pwede mo naman siyang i-drag. Ayan. Once you are done, kapag sa tingin mo sakto na yung position ng pirma mo, i-click lang yung done. And then, save kung kailangan mo siyang i-download. Kung gusto mo na siyang i-forward, For example, uh, sa Gmail, sa Messenger, click mo lang yung send. Uh, I mean, save and share. So, ayan. Click mo yung three lines. And then, more. Download. Download complete. Tapos, merong lalabas ng mga options. Share with, save to drive, pwede siyang sa Facebook, through message, pwede rin. Email, ayan. So, maraming options. At pwede siya sa messenger. So, using dotted line, pwede tayong pumirma. Uh, we can attach... E-signature, and then we can also send it right away. So, that's how we do it. Uh, thank you for watching this video. I hope you learned something.